Hello and welcome back. I'm Eliester and this is more settlers. But first, I have been given an extra key for the Settlers History Edition. So if any of you are interested in that, then write a comment in the comment section of this video and then I will pick a winner of this key. But without further ado, let's get back into the gameplay. Here we are, back in the game. This is our town hall and it is almost done. When the town hall is finished, we will get access to additional buildings, additional goods, and also upgrades of some of our buildings. So, our building is done, our settlement has advanced to the next tier, which as I said, has given us access to some new buildings, which will create some new, some new resources, but we also get access to different levels of um, of buildings, for example, we could see two fishermen's huts there. One of them was for hamlet and another one was for village. So I guess you could say we are village level now. So let's upgrade some of our houses. And by upgrading our houses, we will be able to have more people in those houses. As far as I remember, we go from having one person to two persons in each house. So those settlers has arrived and they are instantly given jobs, so I guess we needed those jobs. I don't... I'm not familiar with those, uh, with those jobs. I guess it's something to do with producing food. So let's get started on some uh, hardwood production because we can do that now that we have the uh, town hall. So we're making some tier 2 woodcutters, but also a forager and some residences because we need to be able to feed these uh, woodcutters. And of course we are roading it up to make it faster to get resources around. And making market stalls for the uh, food infrastructure. And let's make a keep to get some more territory. And wrote that up as well. And I forgot to mention that the keep we placed in the top was a tier 2 keep. So we skipped the hidden time a little bit and our uh, hardwood production is done, so we should get started on making some weapons. So we're making a weapon workshop. And a training grounds. And roading that up as well. So our Weapon workshop is done and our training grounds is also done, so let's get some weapons. So we are boosting our production by adding additional settlers to the building, additional carriers. Let's train some soldiers, let's train a pioneer and a bowman. Mm -hmm. 
So this is the process of our pioneer training. At first he seems like he's not very adept with this club, but uh, he picks it up a little bit and uh, appears to be a little bit better at it now. Mic dropped. I still have all my teeth. And he's done. And our bowmen go through the uh, our bowman goes through the same process by uh, by training archers. We can place them on on walls or buildings where they will deal twenty percent more damage. And archers are long range units, so they are quite useful. So here we are, a little bit further ahead in time. We see more settlers arriving at our harbor and our town has grown quite a bit. This final bit is a little teaser for the video to come because what you see up in the north here is a hero's retreat. We also have our training grounds and we are making an arena. So the next video will be about how to fight our enemies. Please come back for that video. Goodbye.